Good morning, you guys. Welcome to another installment of Morning Oats. I've got the oats. <laughs> I've got the coffee. Now let's start the discussion. I, I mean, honestly, I don't really know <laughs> what I want to talk about right now. Um, I decided that I was going to film Morning Oats, and I kind of wanted to try something different. I honestly have no clue what I'm going to talk about, but I figured I would just sit in front of the camera and eat some oatmeal and see what pops into my crazy head, which is, I mean, it's, it's pretty crazy, I'm not going to lie. I think it's kind of crazy how much I enjoy this, how much I enjoy eating oats and drinking coffee and filming myself and talking to you guys. I think it's kind of funny. It's like I never thought that I would enjoy something like this. You know, enjoy something so simple. I mean, oats are very simple. Coffee's very simple. Talking to a camera, it's very simple. It's all very simple. But all that simpleness is literally what I look forward to every single morning. My morning routine now, this is what it is. I wake up and I'll take a shower. Well, I'll check all my, you guys know how it is. I'll check all my notifications, all my Snapchats, and all my Instagrams, and emails and stuff like that so I'll get that out of the way read some comments of the video that I put up at 5 a.m. because I always put up a video uh, 5 a.m. my time is when I'll schedule it just because that seems to be a good time when people are waking up so I'll check the comments on that see how the video is doing and then I'll go in and I'll take a shower get all that ready clean my room and then what I do is I drink two of these things of water which ends up being about a half gallon and I'll take that with my multivitamin and my fish oil and then I I mean I brew the coffee and I start getting ready for for the, the, whatever episode I might be filming. If I am filming a morning oats, if even if I'm not, I usually sit here and <laughs> eat coffee, eat, eat coffee, and eat oatmeal and drink coffee. Even if I'm not planning on filming, I don't know. I just enjoy this spot with the light, and it's kind of it's just nice sitting in the kitchen and eating this. So I'll sit in here and I'll get so I'll get the coffee ready. I'll brew the coffee. I usually brew it for the whole family, so I'll brew a lot of it. <laughs> And then I start getting my oatmeal ready, however I want to make it for the day, if I want to use peanut butter, if I don't, kind of think of how I want to fit in my food for the day. And then I get that all set up, I'll bring in my camera, I'll set it on the oatmeal that it's sitting on right now, it's a, like a tub, tub of oats, and I'll make sure the focus is hopefully correct, I mean I know, it's a lot of times it's not, I apologize. And and then I just sit here and I'll think about whatever topic it is that I want to think about if I, um, if I asked a question on Twitter. I'll go through my Twitter and read the comments, read the uh, suggestions that you guys have. And then if maybe there's someone that's going to be on the episode or whatever, the video, I'll, I'll you know what I mean, I'll make their oats for them, uh, my brother Brian or whoever it is. I'll make, I'll make their oats for them and I will ask them, you know, how do you like your oats? How do you, how do you want me to make them? Usually they're like, dude, just do whatever you want. And I'm like, cool, because I'm going to make you some really good oats. And then I'll make the oats, bring everything to the table. And then I will just start like kind of talking to them, seeing what they like, what they want to talk about, see if they have any ideas. But if it's just me, I'll sit here and I'll make sure the focus is as correct as I can make it. I'll just think to myself, you know, what's the what's the topic today? What do I want to talk about? And is is this something that I think I can? I mean, kind of just talk about myself, or do you think this is would be something that would be better? with someone and I just kind of sit here and this is my way of I guess relaxing it is it is very relaxing kind of just just talking to you guys and, and just decompressing that's how I feel especially with this video it's very very relaxed and which is nice I I, I enjoy that people ask me like it seems like uh, there'll be comments on videos like how come in more notes you seem like very relaxed and in other videos when you're explaining something you're very upbeat and very excited and I think it I mean it has <laughs> probably something to do with the time of day right it's very early in the morning here so I'm still waking up and then it has to do with how I I kind of want the, the, this video to feel I don't want this to be like what's up you guys we're back in the you know it's like that's not that's not how this video and it, it's like this mentality that I get into when I sit down and I start eating and filming myself I just, I am more relaxed, and there's nothing wrong with not being relaxed. Like, when I am recording, say, a video, like a full day of eating, when I'm being very upbeat, I mean, it's because I'm excited to film that video. And my excitement for, for filming these comes from being relaxed and being being able to kind of just think about whatever it is, whatever topic it is that I want to talk about. And, because I, I, get, I get really excited just talking to the camera because I've gotten comments of people saying, like, I really enjoy this series. This series has helped me. This series means, means a lot. I'm always excited when I see that. So every time that I sit down to record one of these, I think of those comments, and I'm just like, I, I really hope that they like this. And I almost get, I don't want to say I get nervous, but I almost get nervous because it's like, 
I don't want ever to put out a video that people are like, that was really bad, that was stupid, terrible video, next one please, you know. I always want people to maybe get something out of it. I understand this video is probably, you're not going to get much out of it, it's just kind of me talking, but I don't want Morning Oats videos ever to be that serious. I want them to be able to be relaxed and me to just kind of talk about what's going what's going on in my life, what's going on in my head, and, and, and ask you guys what's going on in your heads. What what are you guys going through, you know? What have, have you been dealing with? And what I've been dealing with, I guess we could talk about that, right? I've been doing really well. I'm eating about 25 to 2,600 calories a day. I've been really doing good at keeping that um, consistent. And right now that's pretty much like a maintenance, maybe a slight, slight cut, nothing too crazy. But the, the thing that I struggle with is I track all my food. I track everything that I eat, I track everything that I eat, right? And then on Sundays, I like to kind of relax and hang out with friends and eat and do whatever, right? But the thing that I've been struggling with is like almost, if I'm not tracking, and this is this is something that, I mean, it's, prob it's probably not a good thing, and I, I, I do want to work on this while I'm bringing it up, and, and I think there's a lot of people that struggle with this as well. I, if I'm not tracking, I'm, I'm lost as far as what I should eat, and that's not right. That's, I've never felt like that before. I've never been able to not know what to eat just because I'm not tracking every calorie and it um, that's something that I've been struggling with every Sunday so like on Sundays I this last Sunday this, this happened I I didn't eat that much throughout the day I ate like oats in the morning because I always do and then I had Chipotle later later in the day and then I didn't eat anything until about 10 o'clock and this is my this is my fault this is kind of, I'm trying to let you guys know this is my bad but I didn't want to eat anything because I was like, ah, I don't know what to eat. And I was like hanging out with, I was hanging out at Brian's house and I, he would totally let me eat whatever I wanted at his house. But I'm, I'm kind of like very, whenever there's, like I'm at someone's house, I'm like, ah, I don't want to take any of your stuff, right? So I end up not eating anything and then I get home and I just binge like crazy. I ended up eating like, I don't even know. I Like if I ever have, it's bad. If I have like trail mix or anything like that, I'll end up eating the whole bag and if you know anything about trail mix, it's very high in fat. It's, I mean, it's healthy fats, right? But it's very high in that, so it's very high in calories. So I ended up eating probably 2,000 calories worth of just trail mix for no reason. And then that was on top of eating like, I don't even know how many calories of just like protein bars, and protein cookies, and protein powder, and granola, and all this stuff, just because I was just like, I don't know what to do. I didn't track anything. I have no idea what's going on. And that's not good. <laughs> So that's something that I've been struggling with this week. That's something that, that I've been working with. That's something that I've uh, been kind of, I guess, not embarrassed of, because I'm, I'm not embarrassed of anything. It's something that I think a lot of people are struggling with, and I think a lot of people are dealing with, um, but it's hard to really, I don't, I don't think a lot of people want to talk about it, because, I mean, it is good to track. It's good to have that, but it's all about balance, right? It's all about kind of finding what works for you, and then what will work all the time, you know? I'm, I'm not always gonna be able to track my food. I, I don't think I'm always gonna track my food for the rest of my life. So I do need to work on that balance. And that's, I, I, I am trying, and I, I understand that people are probably gonna comment and say like, you're, you're dumb, you need to, like, that's, you need, you're something wrong, and I, I understand, that's why I brought it up. That's why I, uh, I, want, I want to work on that, and I am. I really am. I honestly am trying to to work on that and make it better. I mean, I'm not sure. I would love if, if there are other people uh, that are dealing with that. If you could let me know in the comments, it would be nice to know. There's some other people that have that same thought process, that have that same um, struggle they're going with on the inside. It would be nice to hear that and um, to, to kind of know that I'm not alone in this. This got really deep. <laughs> it wasn't supposed to be that deep, but I'm almost done with my oats. <laughs> and my coffee, so let me know, please, please let me know if, if, if you're struggling with that, and, and just let me know if you're not, if that's not something you struggle with, how was your week going, how are you doing, I would love to know, um, I would love to get some comments down there and, and, and start that discussion, start that community, because you guys are the best community that I've ever seen, and I'm I'm blessed and lucky and honored to, to be able to call you guys my family, so thank you guys so much for checking out the video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, I have oats on my finger. There's one other thing <laughs> that I wanted to say. Oh yeah, look how buff I am. <laughs>